ROM support many keyboard shortcuts, which can increase your productivity, and everyone can benefit from it. Today, I'm going to go over, from my perspective, the 10 most important keyboard shortcuts for beginners. Personally, I use a PC, so I'll demonstrate it with PC shortcut, but I will also list the Mac command as well. The first keyboard shortcut actually is the escape key. So for instance here, if I click something on this paragraph or this block, then I click on escape, then it's just going to select the whole block. So here then I can do Ctrl C or Ctrl X. This is very useful because sometimes in Rome you can have a lot of embedded tables or graph or structures. Sometimes it's not that obvious to see how to select the blocks or the paragraph. So you just do escape, then that's all you need to do. And also if you go here, content, right? Then there's content nested under this block. Then if you do escape, actually you'll select everything underneath. Same here, if I go article, I do escape, then it will select everything. Similar to escape, there is something I commonly use is Ctrl A. So if you do Ctrl A, then it will just select everything for this paragraph as well. And then if you do Ctrl A again, then it will select everything. There are a few keyboard shortcuts related to sidebar. The obvious one is you just do shift click to a page, i.e. here, if I do shift click, then I'll see this page on the sidebar. Also, then you can do L and then shift click on the page. For instance here, if I do L shift and click this, then I'll see actually the graph with respect to this page. And then there is a control shift click. So if you do control shift click this page, then actually I will see all the page that's referenced to this page or mentioned to this page. Next one is in Rome, whether you want to show the pages with bracket or not. So for instance here, you will have bracket as displayed, but if I want to hide it, I can just do Ctrl C and Ctrl B, then see it disappear. And if I do Ctrl C and Ctrl B again, then it will show up. So this is very convenient. In Rome, if you want to move the whole block to somewhere else, there's a keyboard shortcut for that. For instance, here I have three blocks, block one, block two, and then block three. And I want to move this block three to somewhere here. So I click on this, and I do L, shift, and up, up. And now you can see the blocks three is moved all the way up to here. To move it down, I can do L, shift, and down arrow, down arrow again, and it's back down. So this is very convenient for you to move the whole block. This shortcut I mentioned in the previous video, it's for search a certain block in some page. So the way you do it is you do Control Shift and then 9. Then let's say uh, I can type in the article here. Uh, then I click on the block I want to reference to. And here, you see that block is here. Within ROM, to quickly jump to the search box, you can do Ctrl U, and then do Ctrl J and Ctrl K to go up and go down to select the one you want to search. Within ROM, when you navigating through the page, you can actually just go to the page itself and then do Ctrl O then now actually open that page. And then if you do Control Shift O, it will open the page on the right pane. So basically the Control O is same as single click on the page and Control Shift O is same as shift click on the page.
So if you're in Rome somewhere and you want to quickly jump to the daily page, all you need to do is L and D, and it will go to your current daily page. In Rome, each block is actually like a note in a tree, and you can use L to left or L to right to navigate through the street. For instance, here, this block I can do L right, then I'm actually navigating into this block. And here is actually the path to this block. And I have to do L left, then I go up one step, and then L left again, one step more. So now I'm here. And if I go L left again, and one step up more, and then L left again, and then my book no level, and then L left again. Now to the book. So using L left and right, you can navigate through the block. And that's all for today. There are actually more shortcuts out there. You can find very comprehensive list of shortcuts in sites such as Roam Hacks, Roam Tips, or Roam Brain. I just list the 10 I have here because I find them to be simple and easy to remember. So I hope this is helpful and uh, have a good one. Bye.